peering out over the city this morning, the male peregrine falcon, whose perch is now a recognised part of Norwich's skyline. But it's already been another difficult year for him and his partner. Originally parents of four, they're now down to just one chick in their nest on the Norwich Cathedral platform. In a blow to the efforts of the Hawkenau Trust, one egg was attacked by the mum on April 6th, while a chick died just after being born on May 1st. And then just yesterday, in what appears to be a tragic accident, a chick was caught in her talons and thrown over the edge. There must be an eternal instinct. Um, these are her chicks, they belong to her, and, but she's just inexperienced. It's a very first year breeding and often on a, even a natural nest ledge, such as a cliff ledge, you would see a pair with just one chick. So there's a lot of things that affect them, such as food availability, but here probably inexperience has led to the demise of those two chicks. The news comes after a turbulent 2016 for Norwich's falcon watchers. The current female's an intruder from Bath, and her surprise appearance in Norwich last year scared off the mum of a brood of four chicks. Two of them were found dead, with one of them filmed being knocked off the platform by the invader, and the other two later died, even after they were removed from the nest for their own protection. Despite what's happened, mum is looking after and feeding her remaining chick, which we can watch thanks to the unique insight of the trust cameras. Because they're wild birds, we have to leave them to behave naturally. But it's also quite interesting information. Um, having this special insight into the nest has shown a lot of new things, which possibly could happen more frequently in natural nest sites, but we just don't have the opportunity to get in there and actually find out what's really going on. I mean, no one would monitor a cliff nest for 24-7. So here we're getting a real insight into all of those behaviours and the problems that they face. As for that remaining chick, it's hoped it'll be ringed and recorded in two to three weeks, and that it'll remain in Norwich over the winter as it becomes more independent. Then it'll fly the nest, leaving mum and dad to prepare for a new brood in 2018. Mark Summers, Mustard TV, Norwich.